In this video, you will see the famous island of Koh Lan, located outside of Pattaya in Thailand. This is the beach in Pattaya in Thailand, a city with 120,000 people. In the middle of the city is a marina with boats going out to a lot of the surrounding areas and the islands. Hello everybody and welcome to another video. Uh, today we are going out to the famous island of Koh Lan. It's located here outside of Pattaya. You can take either a speedboat for 150 baht per person or a slower boat that costs 30 baht per person. And that's only about a dollar to go on the slow boat, like a 40 minute ride, but the speedboat takes 15 minutes. So uh, it's quite packed here today, actually a lot of people but uh, we have to go out on the pier and then catch the boat and uh, go on this 20 minute or 15 minute ride. So now we're going on the boat here. Speed boat. Uh, it seems a bit small, but I don't know. Here is the boat that's going to pull on. Big engine. Wow, wow, wow. Life jacket. We need life jackets to get on this boat. The island is located almost 10 kilometers or 6 miles from the city of Pattaya. It was a really bumpy ride, and I thought perhaps it would have been better to go on the slower boat. We have arrived to the island. It was such a bumpy ride. I almost started feeling seasick. I always get seasick, but uh, it was just 15-20 uh, minutes, so I didn't really have time to uh, throw up. But now we're here, so let's get on to the island. This was the other side of the island, and we were behind the mountain, but had to just go on a quick 10-minute ride across to the nice beaches and turquoise water. There are also about 8,000 permanent residents and workers on the island. This is the town here in Kulan. Yes, uh, no, Tuk Tuk. A 7-Eleven here. Tuk Tuk. Tuk Tuk. Tuk, -tuk. Can, you, uh, can you give me special price? <laughs> 200 baht for the hat. 180, okay. How much do you think it's worth? Huh? How much do you think I should pay for this? Uh, I bought the hat here for 160 baht. So we don't get fried, deeply fried. Here we have the tuk-tuks to go to the other part of the island. Apparently that's where we have the best beaches. Here in the town it's not very good. So we're going on this one here. Apparently, there were buses that were going around the island on a regular basis. So we got on one and started heading across the mountain to the nice beaches. So we came to the other side of this island and there's some huge party here. So many people, I don't know what they're doing. A bunch of drones and parties and stuff. I think there's some kind of competition. Hello, what is this? Party? Yeah. What, what kind? Okay. What, what are people doing here? Uh, ceremony. Ceremony? For yeah. what? Uh, competition? The, the celebration of the sales, uh, uh, top sales. Of top. Come. Yeah. House Cup? Yeah. Ah, yeah. okay. I don't know. He said some kind of celebration. We were about to go snorkeling in this incredible water, but I forgot my snorkels, so we had to rent a pair. Is it good? Uh, how much? No good. Yeah. No, no, no. Yes, okay, no problem. This will okay. uh, cut really good. Try it. Is yes, it good? no problem. Хорошо. Do you want to try it? <laughs> now we're gonna go snorkeling here. I'm a bit scared of leaving my bag. Somebody takes it, I'm screwed. So, but here, it's very incredible. 
jumped into the water and the temperature was so great but the snorkels not working very well as they would get a bit stuck. After getting the snorkels fixed we swam out and around the corner of the end of the island where there were some rocks that had fallen from the cliffs. so I could see it when we were snorkeling because I didn't want to put it by the sunbeds like one minute later one minute later I see a lady looking around like this and then reaching for my bag putting her hand on my bag trying to take it I start shouting at her. she like goes away so now I have my bag here so nobody can take it you can never really go snorkeling without being afraid of losing your stuff, especially when I have so many cameras and stuff. Like, crazy. We swam away again and I had taken my bag and hiked across the cliffs to put it in a spot where nobody could get to or I could see it. There were some really sharp sea urchins here and you really had to watch out for your feet. right there now. It's very hard to hide there. <laughs> really sharp rocks. So. This island here is like more like the Thailand you usually see on the internet. Way out of Pattaya where we started this morning. Uh, usually in the big cities, obviously the water is not good there, but here, perfect. There's a viewpoint up here that we're going to after the snorkeling. In this area there were a lot of abandoned houses and it looked like perhaps a hurricane had destroyed them. There's an abandoned building here. Many abandoned buildings there. More abandoned buildings. Nightclub. We're going to the nightclub. Nightclub. Here's the nightclub. I wonder what has been here before. Maybe some huge, maybe a nightclub actually. The scene here, people performing. It's like a horror movie, two tourists in Thailand. <laughs> here there are a bunch of restaurants and uh, uh, places where you can buy drinks. Pretty nice, like really calm and peaceful here. We survived the ghost houses, but it was so hot, so we decided to jump in again. We got some food and saw almost no people there, which was strange since it's the high season. But this was just one out of about 10 beaches on the island. Kusna, 80 baht for this mixed berry drink. 
480 baht for food and two drinks let's see how much is that that's uh three barely 15 dollars almost 15 dollars i think huh the sea temperature was also great and it doesn't really get cold at any part of the year my swim shorts got ripped on a coral and i was walking around like this for like an hour before i even recognized it before we recognized it so this island seems pretty nice actually way way nicer than pattaya and uh not here but uh where we came in over by the pier you can stay there in a hotel i believe i saw a couple of hotels on google maps so if i came to this part of thailand just for like a week or so there's no way i would stay in pattaya i would come and stay here instead this is like the true thailand vibe i think i have been around in thailand in 2016 i went all over thailand for two months and it doesn't really get better than what it is here like the the seawater color it today was a bit choppy actually but um usually it's still it was still like clear blue and clear as you could see in the drone shot yeah we're gonna head back on the boat and then um yeah that will be it oh god 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 <laughs> 200 baht hello tuk tuk if you're in Pattaya, I believe this is a really great day trip to do. It doesn't cost much at all to go on the boat or take the bus to the other side of the island. Now we're back here in the, the city. A bit more crazy here. Can you tell me which boat is it? Okay, give me. It's okay, okay, wait here. Here is the big boat, but we're not going on that one. This is the end of the video. Uh, here is the famous walking street. But thanks for watching. Thumbs up for the video and also don't forget to subscribe. It was a really nice island. But see you in the next video. Thanks for watching this video. Please leave it a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching. You can also post a comment and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see the next video.